inside the box. Oh my gosh. Ah, come on. Air fryer. There's the side of it. There's the back side of it. And there is the last side of our box. Okay. Okay, so this was the Rated highest of the most economical ones. Let's take a look here. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. Looks like some kind of user manual. Oh, I think I paid less than forty dollars for this on sale after Christmas. Hmm. to microwave if you want something crispy. Microwave makes it hot and makes it uh, steam and then turn it hard if you cook it too long. Where this one will make it fried and crispy without all the bad side effects of having lots of grease. Is this some kind of warning down here? Some kind of knobs? Up. Or does it maybe the top doesn't open up? I don't know. I think this comes out. Mm. Let's fiddle with this. Okay. Here's the back side of it. And uh, let's just open up this little package here and see what's inside of here. Start manual. Okay. Oh, well, looks like there's a few more instructions to it. There we go. And uh, looks like a not non quick start manual. Stuck in the bag a little bit. Chef man air fryer. Warning. Okay. Save these instructions. Oh, it's how to fry stuff. Look at that. Oh, it looks so delicious, huh? So wonderful. Eggplant parmesan. Fried vegetables. It's really good. Barbecue wings, apple turnovers, hamburger as well. French fries. Okay. <clears throat> let me uh, fiddle. Look at the directions. Well, actually, let me. There we got some tape here. Let's take this tape off. Cause what the heck, right? some kind of tray that's slanted. I don't understand 
Oh, maybe it comes out. Here's a metal tray and a metal canister. This might be plastic out here, but this is definitely metal. So it has a little thing you can hang on to it. Stick that in there so you can float stuff up on this tray and have it probably blow air around it. Okay. Very cool, huh? heater coil in there, the top, and some kind of fan that blows it around in circles. Okay. There we go. Okay, so we'll have to read the directions and test this thing out. So anyway, here's this outer dial here, we've got the thing running, this outer dial sets the temperature, uh, 200, 250, 300, 350, up to 400, and this is kind of a mechanical timer thing, you twist it and the thing starts clicking, it starts ticking like the old time timers, blue light means it's on and Red means it's hot. It didn't turn red until I turned on the heat. Okay. It is hot already. I can feel the heat radiating off of that. It looks like it shuts down as a safety measure. And a uh, very cool device, huh? I'll have to try sticking some food in there. Okay. I don't think you can hurry up the timer, though. That's have to wait for it to count down so you don't probably want to turn it past where you want it to count because it's going to count forever there. You can hear that ticking. Tick tock, tick tock. Okay, very cool, huh? Smells good. Crispy frozen chicken wings. Mm. Okay, so this is the ones from the air fryer. These are the ones, same ones, done in the regular oven. Okay. Air fryer ones are much more crispy. Okay. These are a little bit uh, more wet. I think it turns out very good though. Okay. Okay, let's check out our onion rings in here. Mmm, looking pretty good. Look at that. Let's try this. Mm. Mm. Nice and crispy. Only took a few minutes to cook them too. This thing gets up to temperature really quick. Okay, so here's a comparison of the um, air fried ones versus oven. Same onion rings. Okay. These look a little bit darker and crispier. Okay. Mm. Yeah, definitely they're chewier from the oven. Crispier from the air fryer. Delicious, huh? Meatballs. Okay, I put my meatball sandwich in there to toast it a little bit. Look at how crispy that bread is. Mm. Beautiful, huh? Let's see, take a look at the bacon in here. Yeah, I think it's probably done. Okay, so the neat thing about this oven is quick, and it gives you a crispy outside. And uh, let's take a look. Here's our fish sticks for our street tacos. Looking pretty good. Look at that. Mmm, delicious. And uh, it's very simple if you just want to do small batches. Let's clean up, huh? 
Okay, so here's probably what the air fryer is best for, is making french fries. Oh, look at that. I made some in the stove to compare. Oh yeah, can you hear that? It's like, mm. Very crispy. Mm. Less crispy. From the oven. Mm. Mm, very good. And since it's uh, such a small heating volume, it usually will heat up faster than you're heating up a big oven. Very good. Okay, here we go. Just uh, take Kentucky Fried Chicken and stick it in the microwave for 30 seconds, and then stick it in the air fryer to make the outside toasty. Mmm, delicious, huh? Warming up Kentucky Fried Chicken. Okay, here's uh, air fried salmon from our air fryer over here, compared with uh, salmon from the oven. Okay. Much crispier surface. stuff on the bottom shelf. cooks things fast. It definitely cooks things fast. There we go. It's a little bit different. Okay, so it makes it a little bit crispy on the top when you cook it in the air fryer. It's still sunny side up though. Mm-hmm. Chili donuts in the air fryer. Mm-mm. 